and big sit on my face. You know what it's like? It hurts. It's mm-hmm. not like coming out. And you like make it, you know, like. Take force too? Yeah, that's what happens. Mm-hmm. Zero. One time I was on live and uh, I was at my house. It took me like, I was on there for like four minutes. And then everyone came on after four minutes. Wonder what because it is. they got the they got the notification late. Oh, there you go, fifteen. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, the real, the real. Hello, hey. What's up, fellas? Hey, hey guys, hey, what's up? Hey, from South Carolina. Hey, hey, hey. Let's see if we get to uh, fifty. All right, guys. So we are currently in the process of putting together a Kickstarter campaign uh, to help launch these gloves. I want to get your opinions. We have, we have two. We have two gloves, and the Kickstarter we have these. These things are so awesome. These are like the cool, like tactical ones. We had these custom built for us, and here's the other one. Let me try them on. Let me just, let me just showcase them for you. Anyone from Pennsylvania? Yeah, we're from Pennsylvania. All right, real quick. <laughs> that guy's what, what do you say? Someone tell my wife my opinion actually matters. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Kevin, your opinion does matter. All right, these gloves right here. This is a classic. These are like the um, we don't have a name for them yet. But these are like the the, the cafe, the cruiser bike. You know, um, strangler type of gloves. Strangler type. <laughs> the, 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 what do you say? The, uh, the Zodiac gloves? Right. <laughs> okay, so um, the color options that we're looking at doing. Black, ox blood, and then uh, okay. like, like a tan or I would think more like a dark brown, like a brown. And then a brown. Not like a working tan. Like a, yeah. Like a hearty tan. The only thing I want to hear from you guys right now is which one would you rather prefer? Black, ox blood, or brown? Everyone's going to say black. Everyone's going to say black, 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 black. They look too hot. I don't, I do kind of mess with the ox blood idea. I love ox blood. I'm going to wear the ox blood ones. The only thing is, Oxblood's not going to match anybody's stuff. But Oxblood matches everything. Everything. Because it stands out. And because it stands out and it contrasts. Like, okay, think about Okay, everyone's wearing blue jeans, whatever color jacket, Oxblood. That's true. I'm saying. I like that name, too. Oxblood sounds super cool. Black, 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 black. Oxblood needs no match. Exactly. Black, 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 brown. Um, Fish. <laughs> is I fish like a- that guy. Ox black. <laughs> ox black. That's nice. Um, what is ox blood? Look it up on the internet. Okay. That's kind of ox blood, but like really, really worn out ox blood. What else do we have? That's ox blood. I don't mean it's ox blood. Um, I'll pull it up on my phone. Color ox blood. It's kind of like a red. You ever, you ever like, you ever uh, kill an ox, and um, that's ox blood. Focus. All right, we're gonna go back and look at all these colors. All right. So for this one. We could do some cool color combo with like with some orange and some white and and uh, some other stuff. I do like white gloves. Um, maybe we can throw some high vis on. That. I think it'd be cool to have some high like some like high vis piping stripe. See, this has some high vis right here. It should have high vis right here. It'd be kind of cool. More like on the knuckles, so you can kind of you know see it. Who's got some ideas about this glove? You like white? Okay, let's just say if you want if all you want is just black, just like the way it is, just say black. If you want a color, say say the color. All I want to see for the next five minutes is just this we're talking about this one, black or color. Ooh, lime green. Black. Black. <laughs> I would love black gloves. Are they waterproof black? They're not. These are definitely not. These are way too light. These are like summertime gloves. Summertime, tactical, they're going to breathe. Um, tactical. Tactical. <laughs> uh, black with color accents, ox blood. 
<laughs> Guys, if you're watching the movie, if you're watching this video, and it's not live. I still want to see your opinion because we're going to another cool thing. We're we're gonna try to make this inner liner a little tank, a little tank thing. Um, I think retro colors would be cool. What kind of retro colors are you talking about? Navy blue. Oh, for these. That'd be something different. We'll have to get our designer and start like, like throwing in different leather. colors. Yeah, I don't know if we can do navy blue leather. Red, see. white, and blue on the tactical gloves. That'd be pretty sick for like a Fourth of July pair. Yeah. That'd be pretty cool. Dead. We can do we can do this cool special edition stuff. Christmas ones like green and red. Yeah. <laughs> Halloween ones. I, 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 yeah, I like these gloves. These gloves pump me up. They do. <laughs> oh, I mean, I mean, <laughs> the screen is strangling. <laughs> America, neon to be seen at night. I used to drive at night. Damn gloves look like my victory style gloves. Yeah, but you know what your victory style gloves don't have? Kevlar. Kevlar. <laughs> them Kevlar and them gloves. I missed the beginning. What are we choosing? Price. All right, guys. He's gonna be around. They're gonna be around the hundred dollar mark. Um, I like Ox gloves. Yes. They need to be smartphone friendly. They are yes. smartphone friendly. Yes. So this one currently is. It's got a touchpad here, touchpad here. This one isn't, and I think they made a mistake. And I'm gonna have to get them to make this smart friendly. There's also a couple things, and I don't know about the the durability of some of these parts. I'm gonna get them to fix that. The um, quality is insane. Like I, yeah. I honestly. I don't know no. if I've had a more quality, and I have, I'm not going to say the brand name, because I don't want to plug them on our own channel right now, but. Yeah, Caleb's got a real expensive brand. I do. Of, uh, of real nice gloves. And jacket, and I honestly think these are way better quality. Like, I'm about to just throw those in the trash and only wear these. Oh, chrome, that's a good right idea. That should have been the, oh, the chrome is the fourth option. Chrome. <laughs> Dude, like a camo special edition would be sick. Ooh. Yeah, they're crazy nice quality. What about a green? Green would be cool. Oh, these could come in green. Okay. Yeah, that's what I mean. Another option would be like a like sand. Oh, like a tactical. Color. Yeah, a tactical sand. That'd be cool. What does this case okay, stabs for? We don't stab very much. Challenger Hellcat Purple. I'm not a big fan of that purple. Everyone likes it, though. Clear. <laughs> Winter or summer. <laughs> Clear. <laughs> Hawk Fisters. Yeah. <laughs> Black Chrome, SRK Cycles, are you friend or foe? <laughs> what is this? Uh, Fortnite? Yes, Tactical Sand would be super cool. Magenta. I don't know what the color magenta is. Digital Camo. Ooh, Digital Camo. So we'll probably just like mess around with a bunch of different designs with this one. This one's going to stick to a few. And maybe the Oxblood will be like the limited edition. Yeah, I want like I will be wearing Oxblood only. I'll be wearing Ox. I love Oxblood. <laughs> I think that's, I think that's that's cool. It is a cool color. Matches my boots. Seafoam green. That'd be funny. Ooh. Has tough knuckles, which helps. Good for bug. I, I've never hit a bug. I've 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 never hit a bug on my knuckle that hurt. Yeah. On my eyeball, yes, but not my knuckle. <laughs> my knuckle, free. I mean, like oh, it's your knuckle. It's what you punch stuff with. You know yeah, what I mean? If a, if a June bug's hurting your knuckle, right? Like I can, I punch stuff. It doesn't hurt my knuckle, but a little tiny bug. White camo. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wrap the van in white pixel camo. Neon pixel fade. Uh, what is this? Circai cycles is some crazy combination of. My first, my first initial, my wife's first initial, my last uh, name first initial. It's also my daughter's initials. Um, we really just came up with ideas. I ran out of stuff. Uh, I use MIG C2 glove. I don't know what that is. Like an old baseball glove. Yes. That's what, that. That's kind of. That's a good. Would that be the? Which one would be like the like the brown, right? That'd be the brown. Yes, the brown would be like an old baseball glove. Write that down. It'd be like yeah. It'd be like a. It, it would be like a. Uh... Could be a really like light, like faded brown, like a like a really old baseball. Glove. I think you'd wear it almost like cowboy boot color, right? Ooh. Like a brown, but it has like creases in it and stuff. Yeah. You know? Feel like a real nice character to it. Yeah. Like a chestnut. Yo, Ross, Sharon, Sherrod, shout out, shout out to Ross. Kayla's voice sounds just like 
Michael Sons, Michael Son in GTA 5. <laughs> I've never played GTA 5. Yeah, wouldn't know. You still have your Dyna? Uh, we gave away one Dyna. We still have it. We haven't shipped, shipped it out yet. It's at the shop getting fixed. We realized it needed some stuff. Um, color of your glasses, blue, black. I don't know what that means. Oxblood, oxblood, oxblood. I'm, I'm all about that oxblood. <laughs> pimp white. Pimp white. I feel like pimp. I, I, I don't know. If we could master it, you know what would be the color to get on a pair of gloves? That matte pearl white. Yeah. If you have gloves in matte pearl white, that'd be insane. But you kind of lose that, like, that roughness of it. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to. No cowboys wear white gloves. <laughs> uh, the one you did 0 to 60 video in that dying, I forget. Army Dark Grace. I like that Army Dark. I think that might be cool for these. That'd be cool. That could be a limited edition. Like an olive green. Um, cool, guys. Listen, if you're watching the video after we're doing it, listen, uh, we are – probably tomorrow we'll have the Kickstarter video done. If you guys want to pre-order, you can do it from the Kickstarter. We have options. Here's the options that we're going to do on the, on the Kickstarter campaign. You can just support us. You can do 30 bucks, and you kind of just support us, but you get a window sticker. Um – we're gonna sell these gloves at the cheapest. We'll probably ever sell them. Would be if you support, if you if you uh pledge ninety bucks, you get a pair of gloves. Uh, either either one, either pair, either one you choose. If you support, if you pledge one hundred sixty bucks, you get the pair of gloves plus an M1 Moto T-shirt. If you do two fifty, you get the gloves, the T-shirt, fifteen minute phone call from us, three fifty. The gloves, T-shirt, phone call, limit. Uh, well, instead of the regular gloves, you get a limited edition gloves. We're gonna do something special with a limited edition. Uh, four hundred bucks, the limited edition, plus everything else, plus you name on one of our credits. Um, there's there's gonna be one where you actually help us name the glove, and for five hundred fifty bucks, an interview with us. A video interview we're going to put on the channel, name on credits, limited edition gloves, shirt, phone call, uh, sticker. The big one. If you pledge $5,000, I know this sounds crazy, but maybe someone will do it. If you pledge $5,000, we will pay you, buy you a ticket for an all-expense trip to come and visit us, hang out with us. We'll take you out for steak, and we'll maybe we'll go shooting to the shooting range, and we'll just... We'll give you like the uh, who's that guy? You can ride some bikes. We'll ride some bikes if you know how to ride. Who's that guy who came from the UK? Uh, Keith. Keith, yeah, we'll give you the Keith treatment. Uh, maybe we'll pick you up in the limo if we have a limo. Probably just the Power Stroke van. Um, that's five thousand bucks. That'd be sick, and you get everything else that we also did. So guys, that's it. Um, we will let you know as soon as we know. If if you're watching this video and it's after, it's after uh. The tenth. Look in the description below. There might be a link to the um to the Kickstarter thing. I am I'm I'm pretty pumped about these gloves. I'm super. I mean, this is the first edition. He's normally like, yeah, you get a first edition, and we have to like redo them a couple times. Uh, I actually really like these. I just want a few a few different changes to make on this, and I want to put a cooler looking liner inside. And uh, but I'm pretty pumped. So I can't wait. My dad got Vance and Hines short shots on his Harley this summer. It sounds awesome. Good to know. Good to know. <laughs> All right. What do you get for five bucks? You get for five bucks. You get to know that you supported us. Um, and I will shout. I will, you didn't even pay. You didn't have to pay five bucks. I'm gonna shout you out, Aaron Waltz or A A Ron. A A Ron. A A Ron Waltz. Candy for the gloves have moonbeams face in the palm. Oh, you know what? You know what would be kind of sick. Pink on the inside. You know, like that special. For breast cancer. My smartphone changes somewhere. Yeah. Wait, no, actually, I don't want to say this on live because I feel like we might have just come up with our special edition pair of glasses. Oh. I'm writing that down. <laughs> Those would be sick. That sick. That would be so sick. I think I need to see the gloves again. We haven't shown them all video. Put that one on. Put this one on. <laughs> all right. So what, what really set, separates these gloves is, um, one, the quality. These are made in America. 
These have the hard knocks. This is the tactical glove. Um, a lot of different types of this is super, this is super fiber, uh, crazy, crazy strong. But in 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 both of these gloves, in the palm and up in the and, and up in here is is Kevlar. These gloves are lined with Kevlar and they are supposed to be incredibly strong. The quality is um, crazy good. And the quality is top notch. I took I took all the gloves we have home and just kind of inspected them. And these are these were by far yeah. like the, the, for the short cuff. This is the best glove out there. Oh, absolutely! I could not find anything close to this. I good. love that this part is like you use your uh, what is it your GPS when you're using a bike and you like have to take your gloves off at the stop sign. And I was using a, I was using a, a thing the other day. I could not use my gloves. It was right. horrible. You have to put a little special sensor inside these things. This one does not have it. Uh, and if you guys can think of any reason why you you would want the sensor on any other finger than your index, than your pointer, than your main finger and your thumb, let us know because we'll we'll throw it on there. I can't think of any reason why you would I want love, that. I love this. That's cool, isn't it? The uh, the strap. That's my biggest pet peeve with mine. Is my strap always comes sometime. Amazing. Dang. All right, guys. Pink. I need some for my snowmobile this winter. You might want snowmobile gloves. <laughs> yeah, you might want snowmobile gloves. These are not snowmobile gloves. Uh, these are not rain gloves. I mean, nothing I have. No motorcycle gear I have is is made for protection and the rain you know i have i put rain stuff on top of everything else so i don't know these are not rain gloves there's not um they're definitely not snowmobile snowmobile gloves totally although I, I i will be wearing these and i will let you know in the winter time i'll be wearing these in the real cold winter and i'll let you know hey these are good for up to 40 degrees or up to whatever they definitely would be fine they're like 40 50 degrees, i would think i mean i, I mean those other gloves we wore i could wear up 30. yeah and those 30 are those degrees and they felt fine um so we'll see how it goes. All right, guys, uh, keep keeping uh, keep around, and um, we will let you know when we launch that Kickstarter. It should be this week, uh, hopefully by Wednesday. Cool, guys. Plastic poncho. Amen. Cool. What would that guy say about the price? What's going to be the price? The price is going to be around 100 bucks, maybe a tad over. It's going to be somewhere in there. These are not cheap gloves. These are uh, – we got these made in America. We, um, we kind of <laughs> – this one glove – for me to manufacture, cost me almost a thousand bucks, just for just for one glove. That's R and D, and that's I'm putting, you know, making one yeah, glove. The, the quality is insane. You know what I mean? Uh, great quality, super tough. Strange so, uh, they're not gonna be cheap. If you want the cheapest gloves, go to Amazon. Just find the five dollar ones, and uh, you know, just take your gamble. Yeah. But uh, we, if you want gloves, like if you want to buy gloves, like once every six months. Right. If you want to buy, if you want to buy some gloves that are gonna last for a long time. Yeah. Um, these are designed by, by a company, by a guy who's been in the glove industry for the past like 50 years. He knows what he's doing. And, um, all right guys, we'll see you guys later.